Hey, it's good to see you. Today, we are gonna be shopping in Walmart for the ingredients to make Southern fried salmon patties. I already have most of these ingredients. I've just kind of marked the ones that I don't have. So we're gonna be getting just some basic ingredients to make Southern fried salmon patties. All right, now like we always do, I'm just gonna put it there. I don't need a whole lot. I need eggs, uh, onions, bell peppers, you know, cornmeal, stuff like that. I'm on the condiments aisle right now. Look at this. Did you know that we have all the ketchup? Look at all this ketchup. You can get all kinds of ketchup. Wow, you can get jalapeno, as Ricky would say from Trailer Park Boys. Jalapeno tomato ketchup. Sriracha, hot chili sauce ketchup. You can even get great value spicy tomato ketchup. We don't need ketchup for this recipe. I just wanted to show you. Organic, if, you're care, if you care about your health, you can get your organic ketchup or simply ketchup. Look at these goofy things. Cranch, ketchup and ranch. Art of the bur burger, mayo chup. Ketchup and mayonnaise, mayo must. Mayonnaise and mustard. Ket chili. Ketchup and chili sauce, I reckon. That <laughs> buffer ranch. <laughs> Chick-fil-A sauce. They have Polynesian and regular. Yes, okay. Well, I don't need that. I need Worcestershire sauce and um, hot sauce. Let's see, Texas, it says Texas Pete hot sauce. That's hotter hot sauce. I don't want that. Well, they're out of that. Well, shoot. Can I just get like Tabasco sauce or something? Does it matter? This is my favorite barbecue sauce right here. G Hughes. This stuff is good. Even if you don't care about low sugar or whatever, it's low carb as well. The hickory is my favorite. The original is good too, but I think hickory is my favorite. I haven't tried this Carolina style barbecue sauce, sweet heat. I haven't tried that, but the hickory is my favorite. So good. Um, let's see. We have Texas Pete barbecue sauce, Carolina mustard, sweet flame. No, I just, dang it, I just need some Texas Pete. It says Texas Pete, but you know what? I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm not a big hot sauce person. We're just gonna grab some Tabasco. They do have Texas Pete wing sauce, but that's not the same thing. Shoot. All right, well, they did have, there's some Texas Pete on an end cap over there, but it's a huge bottle. I don't, I don't want a big bottle. So let's see, Texas Pete hot sauce. All right, now we need to get Worcestershire, Worcestershire, let it, Worcestershire sauce. You know what they need to sell, and I don't think they do, RB sauce. If I could get Arby's, do they do they sell that? They totally should. They should sell Arby's sauce. I may come back and look and see if they do. Where's the Worcestershire sauce? See, I'm thinking it's on this aisle somewhere, but I'd be darned if I know where. We have our salad dressings. Um, it's got to be on this aisle somewhere. Look at all the salad dressings. God. Oh, G. Hughes makes uh, salad dressings too. I haven't tried those though, so I don't know. I don't know how they are. Look at all the salad dressing. I've got the aisle to myself. Nobody's, the cart's fine. Where's the Worcestershire sauce? Look at that tub of Dukes. Look at it. Go. Look at this. You could get a gallon of Dukes. Now we do need, um, we do need mayonnaise for this recipe, but I already have some. Look at the great big cans down there. God, there's Texas Peak, but I certainly don't need that much. These are just like the bulk, bulk items. I think I went past the Worcestershire sauce. Let's see. Balsamic vinegar. 
It's because nobody ever has to buy Worcestershire sauce. Nobody ever runs out. Like, you don't ever run out of that stuff. Let's see. Oh, there it is. God almighty. I remember my mom. My mom had a bottle of this stuff, and it, she had the same bottle, I swear, for 20 years, this kitchen bouquet. I never saw her use it, but she had a bottle of that. Is this the only Worcestershire? Hang on. No, this is a dollar. This is a dollar. This works for me. Yeah, that's a buck. I think I can go for I can go for that for a dollar. You can get little Texas Pete pepper sauce. I don't want the hot or hot sauce. But wouldn't it be great if they had Arby sauce? I mean, maybe they do. I'm just looking while I'm thinking about it. We have all kinds of barbecue sauces. These are barbecue sauce. Sticky Fingers, Memphis Style, Sweet and Smoky, Carolina Treat. I've never heard of some of these. They even have John Boy and Billy grilling sauces. We have Dukes. Look here, Dukes Southern Sauces, Georgia Sweet Heat Barbecue, Hickory Moonshine, Carolina Gold, Tennessee Smoke and Whiskey, Alabama White. Those are kind of like the ones they had at uh, at the um, the barbecue place we went to the other day, Little Richards or whatever. Yeah, they had those. Okay, so we got our. This is just plain old barbecue sauce. We don't even need that much. All right. So mark that off. Worcestershire sauce. Let's see. All right, now I need garlic powder and eggs. I need a couple of. I need eggs. Look at those big old boxes of Fruit Loops. Woo! We have Reese's Puffs, Lucky Charms. We can go to the baking, not the bacon, not bacon, baking aisle. Look, we have pumpkin spice Cheerios, strawberry banana, honey vanilla, apple cinnamon. I don't need any of that, but that's cool. Okay, garlic powder is gonna be down here on this aisle. Look at all these cake mixes. We did a video here looking at this stuff not too long ago. It hasn't really changed a whole lot. This is going to be, I think this is going to be a fun little video to do. It's very simple. It has just very simple ingredients. Anybody could do it. All right. We need garlic, garlic powder. It does not have to be fancy. Sometimes these are kind of alphabetized. We have minced onion. That's not it. Garlic salt, garlic powder. Here's a garlic powder. Oh, they go down here. Okay. These are a dollar, so we'll get some garlic powder. There. Garlic powder. Yeah, I don't really need much. Oh, yellow cornmeal. That's, my cart's fine. You can get these fun little biscuit mixes. Look, Southern Biscuit. And I don't know what that means. Formula L complete biscuit mix has golden shortening flakes in it, and you just add buttermilk for 444. You could get Jiffy buttermilk mix, buttermilk biscuits, cornbread mixes. Ooh, cinnamon spice cornbread. But that's good. No, we just need yellow cornmeal. Uh, this is flour. These are flowers. Um, cornmeal. Where's the cornmeal? Oh, right here. Yellow corn. Okay, now that's a yellow cornmeal mix. Yellow cornmeal. Yellow cornmeal right there. For baking and breading. Enriched and degerminated. That sounds exciting. Okay. So there's our yellow cornmeal. 
We also need two whole eggs. I don't have any eggs right now. I have zero. I don't have any at all. Oh, my son wanted me to pick up some jello for him if they have it. My son has fallen in love with the Sonic Jello. I don't see it. They have Starburst Jello. Do they have the Sonic Jello? They don't have it at every Walmart. They only have it at some of the locations. I'll just go ahead and get him a. We'll get him a. I might be looking right at it, but. Look at this is it for the recipe. This my son just asked me to get him some jello. <laughs> I'm just gonna get him one. Okay. Well let's go get some eggs. Look at eggs. Okay. What do we have over here? Big old boxes of Pop Tarts and all the toilet paper in the world. You can wipe your butt for years. Let's see. Look at these big old boxes of Kleenex. This is ultra soft. You get four of them. Wow. Nice. Over here we have, this is, oh, look at these little drinks. Sparkling water. We have all of our orange juices. Look at all the orange juice. And other juices, you could get peach Oh, peach punch. I bet that's good. Great punch. We have Sunny Delight. Milo's Hunt Zero Calorie Sweet Tea. I bet that tastes like ass. There's another sugar-free sweet tea. Is that a thing that people do now? And down here you can get Milo's Famous Sweet Tea. Or you can get great value sweet tea. That's two seventy eight. Milo's is three eighteen. Yes. Butter. We got butter everywhere. Got butter out the yin yang. Cream cheese. Little cream cheese biscuits. This is biscuit dough right here. Eight big biscuits, and you bake them. That's honey butter flavor. Or you could get buttermilk butter tasting, pie crust, pizza crust, cookie dough. God, look at all the cookie dough. That's all cookie dough. What are these? Hint little, oh, it's monsters. Look at that, like Count Chocula and Frankenberry. Those are $4.98. Tubes of cookie dough. Wow. Okay, and then we get into the eggs. I don't want a whole bunch of eggs. We actually don't eat a lot of eggs. Six eggs is a dollar twenty-six. That's crazy. Let's see. Oh, that one's got yellow stuff on it. Let me try a different one. These look. These are all right. We we only need two for the recipe. We only need two, two whole eggs. All right, and we also, the only other two things I need are onions and bell peppers. I have everything else. All right, but see, you can get big old, you could get, you could get like a box. You could get five dozen eggs for 1067. Jumbo eggs, large, you could get cage free brown eggs, organic, yeah, you can get all that. Look at the little baby drinks. You can get little baby sodas. <laughs> That's so cute. Look at the little baby drinks. Oh, yeah. They're $2.98, which is basically the same price as getting, you could get a whole thing of 12-ounce bottles for the same price. Okay. Oh, these right here, this is one of my favorite drinks right here, Nature's Twist, sugar-free orangeade. Oh, it's so good. I want that. That's not for the recipe. That's, <laughs> that's for me. Okay. We have air fresheners out here in the middle. Look at all this. You can make everything not stink. 
What do we have over here? Look at the chips. We have our Pringles over here. Lots of fun little Pringles. Cheez-Its popped corn. Light, cheesy light and popped. Little popcorn or puffs. Wow. Oh, I love these right here. The Gardettos Rye Crisp. Oh, gosh. They're so good. They used to have big bags of combos right here, but they, I don't think they have them anymore. I used to buy those. My kids love the big bags of combos, but. Oh, they have hot balls. Look, you could get a whole bucket of hot balls. Look at that. Red hot baked cheddar cheese balls for $7.28 or the regular, the regular ones for $7.28. Yes. Oh, look at the little cat house. <laughs> Kitty City. It's a it's a cat. It's a Halloween house. That's cute. Okay, so we need to go find onions and bell peppers. It's pretty quiet. It's kind of early in the morning. I try to come in here early. The only problem with coming in here early is that you run into. Let me get one of these. My son likes these strawberry kiwi Capri Suns. The only bad thing about coming in here early is they put out stock, and sometimes the people putting out stock are noisier than the customers. <laughs> but I know they got to do their job. I'm not. I'm not criticizing. Oh, look at these pants! Look at these cute little pants. These are $14.98, and you can just get like plain green ones. Oh, look at this robe. Oh, isn't this pretty? This is $24.98. That's cute. We have little nightmare before Christmas pajamas. You get socks, too. <laughs> oh, look at the cute little shorts. Oh. Now, I don't understand these vests right here, these super long Swiss Tech vests. Aren't your arms going to be cold? I mean, it's long, but... Aren't your arms gonna get, I think your arms would get cold in that. <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh, and look over here, we have our Halloween cookies. Well, this is a pumpkin cookie kit. Look at this, you could decorate your little pumpkin cookies. We have Day of the Dead over here. You can get frosted sugar cookies. <gasps> look at this, gourmet Halloween bark. Look how colorful it is. Wow. We have pretzel crunchers. You can get a big thing of cookies. Look, gosh. This is a $5.98 for the big thing. You can get sparkle pumpkins. Oh, it has sparkly sugar that you put on the pumpkins. And we have 16 witch's brew cookies. That's so cute. They have so many sets. A haunted village cookie kit. A spooky Halloween cookie kit. <laughs> They've really expanded their offerings. Ooh, we have pumpkin cake bites. What are these? Cream cheese frosted pumpkin cookies. Triple chocolate and strawberry muffins. Gosh, they're huge. You could get marshmallow treats. Pumpkin cake roll. Frosted sugar cookies. Oh, they're chocolate. Ooh. My cart's fine. Little ghost. <laughs> Here we have a mix. Drizzled caramel popcorn with candy corn. Oh, I bought, I've bought one of these little kits right here. We're gonna be coloring cookies later on. Sugar cookies. We have pumpkin hand pies. Look at that. Brownie bites. What's this? Pumpkin sandwich cookies. Gosh. And a pretzel mix. You have your dipped pretzels. Pumpkin spice muffins. And they have the little cookie kits going all the way around. Okay. Let's go look for onions. I need onions. Onions and green peppers. Look at the little snacks over here. Foodles. <laughs> Foodles, that's cute. You could get your little vegetable trays. 
fruit. I don't need that. Um, I need a green pepper. Where am I going to find a green pepper? I'm going to put my cart right here. It's okay. It's all right. I'm going to run over here. I need a bag. Where am I going to find a bag? We have our little mandarins. Here's an onion. I just want a small one. Watson. What kind of onions are these? They're just white onions. Do we have any other onions? Tomatoes. We have potatoes over here. And spaghetti squash. Look at the taters. We don't need any potatoes. There's a free range tater right there. He's trying to escape. Pineapples, wow. Look at the big old grapefruits. Yes. Well, okay. This is the only onion I see. Well, wait, there's some over there. Let's see. I don't guess it matters, let's see. I, see, I don't want a whole bag. Are these Vidalias? Sweet onions. I think I'll just go with this one. We've got Vidalias right there. It doesn't specify, so I guess you can use whatever onion you want to. Whatever, whatever kind you like. You only need a quarter of a cup, though. These are organic onions. Highfalutin. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't specify, and you only need a quarter of a cup. So... I don't think it matters. Let's see. I gotta cut up an onion. That's always fun. Um, and I need a green pepper. A green pepper. Oh. I don't see any green peppers. Shoot. I don't want those. Those. They don't, am I blind? I don't see any green peppers. Well, okay, I'll just go to another store for my green pepper, I suppose, because I don't see it. Got all of our green crunchy stuff. Carrots. Well, that's all right. That's okay. I will just go to a different store. It always works out that way. No matter what I'm buying, I always have to go to two stores to get it all. It never fails. Okay. Oh, look at the pumpkins. Aren't they cute? Look at the little, look at these happy little pumpkins. Now these pumpkins are $4.48 and look how cute they are. And you can get these big, uh, autumn color pumpkins these are 648 aren't they interesting and we still have some watermelons got some watermelons oh look at these big pumpkins wow these are um well these are 448 i don't know if these are the same price or not look they're pumpkin pumpkins they're pumpkin pumpkins yes Big old pumpkins, or you could get a whole bag of, of little gourds. Look. Ooh, that one's awful. Look at that brown one. Oh God, it's rotted. These things stink. <laughs> they do, they stink. <laughs> they stink. They're pretty, but there's some stinky ones in there. All right. So I think that's about gonna do it. I don't really need anything else, so I'm going to have to go somewhere else to get my green peppers, I, my green pepper, I suppose, but see, they have these great big things of Texas Pete, but I don't, I don't need one like that. Yeah, that's too, that's too big. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed just walking around in Walmart this morning a little bit and picking up a few grocery items for the salmon patties that we're going to make later. 
So thank you so much for being here. I really hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll see you again soon.